Hello, everyone. You join me on the beautiful east coast of North Carolina again with my 2018 Tesla Model 3 that's edging closer and closer to 80,000 miles. But today, it's a really exciting day for me. It's uh, 7.46 in the morning, and I have in a couple hours an appointment at my local Tesla service center to upgrade from the Autopilot 2.5 computer to full self-driving, and then we'll subscribe to the software and... I'll be getting full self-driving today, and I'm super excited. I'm going to walk you guys through the process. If you guys have an older Tesla that is not full self-driving capable, I'm going to show you what that process is like, how much it costs, how smooth or not smooth it is. Now, the service center is about an hour and a half away because here on the Outer Banks, there's not much of mainstream anything. But anyway, let's get started on this drive. Now, before we actually go on this drive, I do want to show you what it's like to set up an appointment to get your full self-driving computer upgrade within the Tesla app. So you want to open it, you want to scroll down to Upgrades, Software Upgrades, and Full Self-Driving Capability under the Subscribe section. And then what I just did is press Learn, Schedule Installation, and the app will give you available times at your local Tesla service center. You set that up, they give you an estimate, you accept it, and then you're good to go. You show up for your service appointment and I guess we'll see how smoothly the rest of the process goes. Just pulling up to the Tesla service center, about to drop off this car, and I'll update you guys once we get this car all dropped off and checked in. All right, so we just checked in our car over at the service center. They said it's gonna take about all day, whatever that means. So we're gonna figure out some stuff to do. My sister's in the car right there. But they gave us a loaner in the meantime, so we're not gonna be stuck in the service center lounge all day, which is really nice. But I will say, this thing is super dirty. <laughs> like. Look at how dirty this thing is. It's like it was never vacuumed in its life. There's like spilled coffee everywhere. Yeah, not great, but <laughs> it's all right. It'll get us places and I'll update you guys whenever we decide what we're gonna do. So since they said the upgrade is gonna take basically all day, I decided to come to Dave and Buster's. My sister's here with me. So we're gonna play some games. The mall's right over there. So it's gonna pass the time. So thank goodness Tesla gave us a loaner, otherwise we would have been stuck in the service center for like, what, six hours? Maybe more? Because they said they're going to be done at around five, but it might be later than that. So we're at the mall right now, Dave & Buster's got a little boring. I got food, but now I'm really tired, but still waiting, hopefully they'll be done early. Doubt it, but we'll see. So we got bored at the mall, and so we decided to go to H&M and get some bathing suits and swimming trunks so we can go 25 minutes to the beach, because yeah. we have so many hours to spare. Yeah, so, pre, like beach, pre-airport. We love it. Oh yeah, she's flying out oh, later yeah. today too, so, so it'll be fun. All right, guys, we made it to the beach. Woo! And this is the loaner Model 3 they gave us. I hate the color, but it's actually really nice because it has the full self-driving package included, which is what I'm getting an upgrade for. So I got to test it out a little bit. I'll leave some footage in there. But anyway, in the meantime, we're going to go to the beach while we wait. <laughs> Alright guys, we just spent a couple hours at the beach. That was really relaxing, wouldn't you say? Ah. 
Yes. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was it was super nice. We just bought some swimming trunks and towels and whatever. Definitely weren't prepared ahead of time, but that's okay. No, I was covered in sand. Yeah, that's because she didn't want to buy a towel. She's cheap. But anyway, we're on our way back to the service center. Somehow we got 45 minutes away from it. So by the time we get there, the car should be ready. They said it might take longer, but we'll see. Busiest intersection. <laughs> ah, this makes me so nervous. <laughs> Alright, guys, we just parked in the service center. We're still in the loaner because the car is not quite done yet. Don't know when it's gonna be. Haven't talked to them yet, but I should get a notification whenever it's done. So we're gonna figure out what to do in the meantime. I have no idea how long it's gonna take. But take a nap. <laughs> yes, <laughs> probably not. I did that on the beach, if you can't tell. A little bit red, but it was a nice time, so I'll catch up with you guys once I get the car. All right, guys, it is currently 7.30 p.m., so that really did take all day. We're back in my trusty old Model 3, and look at what we have here. We have the full self-driving computer now with full self-driving capability until April 20th. Unfortunately, that was not free. I had to pay the $99 a month. I didn't get a free trial like a lot of other people, but it is what it is. I was gonna pay for it anyway. But man, this took all day. What I would recommend is if you're planning on getting a upgrade from Autopilot 2.5 computer to full self-driving, just if you have to travel even an hour to get to the service center, I would set aside like a whole day being in whatever city the service center is in because it's gonna take a long time. I dropped this car off at 11 a.m. and I just now picked it up like 10 minutes ago. So it's it's a very long process. I got to go to the mall, I got to go to the beach, I got to do just about everything in this whole day. So fair warning, it will take a long time, but I think it was worth it. And the total was pretty steep. It was $1,060, but it is a long labor process, if you couldn't already tell, but anyway, that's going to conclude it for this video. I am definitely planning on posting some full self-driving content. That's basically the main reason I got this, and just be on the lookout for that. I'll be posting it on X and YouTube, and yeah, more to come soon. Thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys later.